The Bosque School Athletic Program is known for state titles in tennis, soccer, cross country, volleyball, and even golf, but not basketball. It's very different because, you know, in previous years we haven't been that team. We haven't been a team that people are really trying to go after. And, you know, it's not our goal to, to prove anybody wrong. It's our goal to go as far as we can and to continue to perform. Now the Bobcats sit on top of the basketball world as one of the teams to beat. Well, we're a really fast team. We move down the court really quickly. Uh, we play really tough defense and we um, shoot a lot of three-pointers. Um, I'd say we're just a good all-around team and really fun to watch. One high flyer who is fun to watch is senior Eli Davison. If you haven't seen him, you need to because a very exciting player. Eli is pretty much the most insane athlete I've ever played with. He could just change the momentum of the game so fast and ridiculous hops. <laughs> Eli Davison is 6'4", averaging about 20 points a game and committed to play basketball at Western Colorado University. I think he's the best player in New Mexico, right? I, obviously nobody sees him because he plays here. Um, and I always challenge anybody. You come here, you watch him play, you, you wouldn't question that anymore. Uh, but more than that, he's a team player. He cares more about uh, making this team really successful than he does about his own stats, than he does about any accolades or any of that sort of stuff. And that's what helps all of these guys perform very well. Sometimes you have to sacrifice, and that's one of the things we focus on is that I could be putting up like 45 points and you know doing my thing, but if we're not winning and we're not being a team and it's not working, then there's no point in doing it. He's the leader. You know, he makes sure that everybody's involved. He passes the ball. He, we make him score. He would rather get 20 assists than 20 points. Even with one of the top records in Class 3A and one of the most dynamic players on the court, it's still tough to change the perception of the Bobcats. I think people still look at us and say, they're, that's still Bosky. You know, they're still Bosky Bobcats and, and people still expect to, to beat us. Um, and they still expect uh, that everything that's happening is a fluke. So <laughs> we're okay with that. It's certainly fun to have the challenge of, you know, a team bringing their best to you and, you know, trying to stay ahead of them for the whole game. Bosque has never won a state basketball championship. In fact, they've never even played in the final game. Our motto this year is together we rise. Okay, and the reason we say that is, you know, we have started to build that relationship, build, a, build that family, build our core, and we want to bring that up. Uh, from the bottom to the top. We'll see if the Bobcats can rise to the top and reach the final on March 14th. Reporting for the New Mexico Activities Association, I'm J.P. Murrieta. Are you living the life of an athlete? The New Mexico Activities Association brings you Life of an Athlete, a resource for students, educators, and parents to understand the challenges students face. Athletes, did you know one night of drinking will negatively affect your athletic performance for two weeks? Or that athletes who drink and do drugs are twice as likely to get injured? Alcohol's effects can reduce a high school athlete's potential by as much as 20 to 30%. Are you living the life of an athlete? Log on to lifeofanathlete.com to find out today.